it again. So what we're putting up tonight. <coughs> right, I'm gonna put the Lawson hammock up again tonight, along with the Lawson under blanket. So big thanks to Lawson Hammocks. They've also sent me uh ends that fancy buying one of these. Uh, they've sent me a 15% discount code so that's pretty good of them this is a really good hammock especially the fact that it doubles up not just as a hammock but as a bivvy so you've probably seen a couple of previous videos I've done with this but it really is a great bit of gear and like I say 15% off I'll stick the discount code down in the description if anybody's thinking of buying one but they're really really good so Let's get it up. All set up. So, this is the Lawson hammock. Really is. I really like it. Definitely a brilliant bit of gear. Very easy to put up. Uh, again, you can tighten up. You don't even need a ratchet or anything, just all tightens up. Nice, and all clips together. Really is. Really, really do like this hammock. So, Get in there, 15% off as you're looking for one. Right, what are doing now? Uh, I'm going to chop up some wood, prep some firewood for tonight. So I'll get the Hultifor's trekking axe. I think I'm going to need to redo my, my cover here. It's kind of fallen down, so I need to sort that. And tonight I'll get the Bajo. You've probably seen a lot of folk using these, really really good wee saw. This and the other one I've got, they're both good saws. This one I find, the Bajo's got a much more solid blade on it. Uh, it doesn't bend as easy. But, first things first, let's, uh, let's cut some wood, chop some wood. 
Let's get some firewood ready. Wood prepped. So, I've got a nice wee pile there. So, that'll do me for later on. Uh, <sighs> it's always just chopping wood. Keeps you fat. That's probably how it keeps her thin there. But, we've got the wood prepped. We've got the horse and hammer cup. I'll do a wee bit of cooking later on. A couple of ciders a night, I think. Why not? Uh, but anyway, that's me. I'm kind of more or less ready to go. So it's been cracking. I've been working all day, but it's been a nice sunny day today. So I'm going to enjoy a wee bit of this sunshine before it disappears. And then we'll bring you back. Stay tuned. Right, cooking wise tonight. TF grill. I've got the Bitty Big Q The Tractable Grill I've seen me use this before But oh, this really is I love this It's just a, it's just a brilliant design Excuse the, the noise Obviously I'm just doing the backwoods So if you can hear you can hear kids and everything running about. There was about ten of them off earlier on. What are you doing? What are you doing? It's like I'm camp I'm camping. What you you're gonna spend the night in that? It's like, oh aye. You're right, um. Right, so buggy bit Q sorry. Bitty big Q. I say that wrong every time, but great bit of gear. And I do, I know he said that they'll maybe send me something to do a giveaway. I don't know if it'll be one of these grills or whether it'll be the titanium cut and the cutlery set. I don't know yet. But he says kind of springtime he's going to send me something for a giveaway. So you can look forward to that. Oh yeah. So that's, what, that's ready. Frying pan's ready. We need now some tea. But, before we do that, I'm just going to try something. So you've probably seen, I don't know where I've posted that vid, the other video yet, right? But, I've got myself a wee, one of these drones. So, it's not a DJI or anything, it's just one of these cheap ones that you can buy. Right, but I'm going to give it a bash, see what it's like. So it's pretty good, comes, uh, comes obviously, the main wee unit. You can get it in all different, you can get 1080p, 4k, 720, I'll just get the 1080, maybe should I get the 4k but, why worry, so, 
So it's obviously it's just a it's a copy of one of these DJI things. Right, but I just got it just to see if it was any good. And the best it was, uh, I sent it away for it, it said it had this, you know, that technology that it follows you and that arrived. It's no more like that. So I phoned up and complained, and I got it for nothing. And you know how I like a freebie. Because you know what they say, the best things in life are free. So I'm going to stick the battery in that, stick it on, and let's see if I can fly it without crashing it and get a tiny wee bit of footage. So we'll soon find out. Stay tuned. Well, you can tell for that, I'm not a drone pilot. <laughs> I got crashed it about five times there. <laughs> I've crashed it five times and I've, I've managed to lose a bit off it. So I think I need a bit of practice. Uh, I probably should be doing it in the woods. There's about 50 million trees that I can bang into. I should really take it out into the open first. Because, well, you can see for that footage, that was a disaster. But, hey ho, I know it works. I know it, I know it flies. I just need to get a bit of practice in before I know it. I hope to get some good footage with that. But as you can see for that footage I just took terrible. Terrible. <laughs> it's getting dark now, so it's time to get the fire on and time to get cooking. I'm actually quite hungry now, so we start a couple of those nice, as it call them, Glasgow rolls. Mm -hmm. In there, kind of hard, kind of crusty. Oh, they're lovely. Right, I've got a chilli, chopped red onion, mozzarella cheese, a good old Pollock Williamson steak sausage. So, I'm just going to have that for my starter, and then I've got a wee pasta number, a wee tuna pasta for, for later on. So, first things first, let's get the fire started. Twisted fire starter. <laughs> right, we'll start a fire late with, yeah, with flint and steel, but for tonight, nice and easy. Fire lighter, boom, ready to go. So good, and right, let's get cooking. Toasty, toasty. Ready for the sizzle? So, a couple. Of... Oh. Flaming hot. So onions, chilies, sausage. Okay. Let's just get the rest of this out. Oh, 
so go ahead and oh yes so TF grill bitty big Q sorry aye well it's a TF grill but it's a bitty big Q foldable retractable grill that I'm using oh I think it's going to taste amazing and this is just the starter Hey folks, how well that's uh, how well that's cooking away. It's time for it's time for her. You know what time it is. El Cidre time. <sighs> Cheers. <sighs> Lovely. So first course. So I've still got the mozzarella cheese just to chuck on the top of those uh, burger sauces, whatever you want to call them. Oh yes, you know it's going to taste superb. Save the mozzarella cheese. Oh, yes. Pile it on. Pile it on. Whew. Yeah, just turn it over and melt that cheese down, and then that'll be good to go in the rolls. Fantastic. Oh, I think it's good to go. Oh. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Oh, look at that. Cheese tastic. Oh. Top banana. Right, some of that onion on the top. Oh, caramelised onion. Absolutely delicious. Right, just to round it off, a wee bit of HP brown sauce. Oh, immense. Oh yes, look at the bad boys. Oh, oh you know they're going to taste superb. And dabby dozy. Taste test time. Oh yes. Mm. Oh. oh, that's delish. Delicious. You really love cooking out in the woods, don't you? I know I do. I don't know why. It just almost tastes a million times better. <laughs> Stringy cheese. Or that off. Anyway, I'm going to score for you. Think about it a minute. Hmm, very nice indeed. Missing that getting off two of them, but that's the first course. Uh, I'll get tuna pasta, that, that'll come later. Right now, though, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna sit by the fire and enjoy. Enjoy.
But I'm looking forward to getting back out. I'm quite sure I've lived there, eh? Oh, I can't wait. It's safe to just go further afield. I really, I know I keep saying it, but I cannot wait. It's just gonna, oh, it's just gonna be so good. I think everybody's got the same idea. I was, I was laughing at some of the comments. Folks saying, I've got my, I've got my car packed for, for a week. Is it Tam? Tam Spoon? I've got my car, my, my car's packed, packed for a week for when we're allowed out. I think everybody's getting their bags back, there's folk posting things about eh, all the new kit they've bought and nobody able to use. I just think there's going to be a mass exodus of people, aren't there? Do you want to lock down by? Oh, just, it's going to be, the thing is though, it's going to be trying to find a spot. There's no deals there because everybody's going to be at I know a few spots. Oh yes. I'll not be stuck. <sighs> it's getting on. Uh, so the cider's finished. Hey <laughs> god. Do you know what else? I've got my I've got my chocolate biscuits, don't I? So it's just going to have to be a brew tonight. Oh, hey ho. You've got to love a brew, don't you? So I'm going to sit and have this. Fire's roaring. Moon's out, as you can see in the background. Either that or either that's a flying saucer. I'm just gonna sit and chill by the fire. Sit and chill by the fire and think, where am I gonna go? Where am I gonna go when lockdown's finished? I'm quite looking forward to getting my hammock tonight. That wasn't hammock really is, it's a, it's a comfy, comfy hammock. Hopefully it'll be a nice day tomorrow. Be out round the, out and about. Although soon that I might do a like I got that hot tent, so I'll maybe do a, a wee set up video of that. Saturday night live tomorrow. Oh yes. So the Saturday night live seem to will definitely seem pretty popular. Quite a few folk tuning in. I think everybody likes a laugh, don't they? Especially the new. We're all stuck in, we're not going to go anywhere. Oh, I just love, I really do love a brew. Oh, I was going to wolf in, I was going to make tuna pasta, but <laughs> I know it's not like me, but I just can't get bothered. I'll have that, I'll maybe have that tomorrow night in the hot tent. I've also got a nice big juicy ribeye steak. So, I might, uh, well I might have that tomorrow, but I might have the tuna a bit. I'll probably have the steak, won't I? You can't even eat a juicy steak. It's getting pretty this, I don't know, must be about midnight now, so I'll probably look at just heading into the hammock soon, crashing out for the night. But it's just been good to get out again, just get out and out in the fresh air, sit by a fire, chill a little villain. Nothing beats it. Oh, that brew is good. I'll maybe have another one before I go to my bed. But right now I'm just going to sit and enjoy. Oh, just something about a fire, isn't there? Just, just, oh, it's just great. That crack on sound. 
I will be looking forward though to, to meeting up with a few folk. I like a solo camp, but I like a group camp as well. It just feels like I've been solo camping for a year. <laughs> okay. Hey ho. It's all good fun. That's us. <sighs> In the hammock. Comfy as. So I'm going to crash out for the night. Bring you back in the morning. Have a good wee night. Thanks for tuning in, folks. Adios. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the dogs bite. Oh. <sighs> Right, folks, uh, great night's sleep, it really is, oh, it's just a, such a comfy hammock, and there's just so much space on it, it's just it's brilliant. So what I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to get up, uh, pack up, today's another day, so, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do today, well, saying that I don't know what I'm going to do, I'll probably get up in the... A new hot tent, so we'll be set up and do a wee, wee review of video on that, and then I'll do the Saturday Night Live. So I don't know when I'll post this, but I'll oh, good camp or hammock camp. So I'm gonna get up. Oh, in fact, I'm gonna get up. I don't know, I could just lie here all day, but it's light now, so I better get up. So Thanks for watching, we'll catch you in the next one.